Hey guys, it's Slender again. Today I have something really, really freaking awesome, exciting to show you. So, I tried this minimap before. This is the Overwolf minimap. Uh, you might have heard people talking about it. I'm sure tons of you already use it. And tons of you may already know about this, but I didn't. <clears throat> so this minimap, I'm going to show you where to download it. Super, super easy. And uh, before we even get into this, I just want to show you right now that this is 100% legitimate. And this is the most recent uh, dev post from, uh, you know, AGS regarding the minimap. So I'm just going to read it really quick. I'd like to take a moment of your time to address the minimap conversion or conversation. We've been following the conversation on the forums. We believe we understand the reasons players want a minimap. Also, we are aware that there, there is a perception if we implement a minimap, mini map, then players that don't want them can simply turn it off. But in reality, players may feel at a disadvantage without it. Uh, I don't know, whatever. Uh, right now, creating a minimap is not high, pri high priority for us, as we have other items we feel are more pressing. The high-level reasoning is that we have concerns with it meshing with the New World's action combat style and world design. That it could break immersion, which it can, it can uh, may limit the drive for exploration, and there are technical limitations. I don't know about that, but uh, third-party people got around the, those technical limitations. We feel the compass fulfills the needs, fits the setting, promotes exploration, and supports combat. Diving into some specifics, a big part of our combat situational awareness, blah, 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 blah. Uh, another concern is that players may play the minimap or at least stare at it as opposed to, yep, looking at the screen. Uh, we will continue. Sorry, just going to get to the main thing. We will continue to follow the conversation, gather more information, and we'll periodically reevaluate our position as we do in many decisions. All that said, we have discussed the matter with Overwolf and have decided not to penalize minimap mods from this third party, provided that they stick to the following rules. As a general rule, the minimap follows exact rules of compass and cannot give players an advantage of any type over the compass. Information to be used for display, even within the limitations expressed below, must come from the Overwolf API, which we may add to, to over time but can't commit to it, can't commit to at the moment. The minimap can show the player position, show folks in a group as we do on Compass, only show node placement if they've unlocked that node via trade skills, provided it is within the range that Compass would display them. So no help at all. Uh, and that's what I wanted to talk about. And only show AI that you've unlocked via trade skills as Compass and within range of Compass. Show quests as they do on Compass. Um, in the future, we may change our position. So, you know, we just have to watch out for that. Make sure there's no, and I'm following the dev post every day I come here. Make sure there's nothing new. Um, uh, we may change our position on this and decided and decide to add a mini map or change our position on allowing Overwolf. If we were to change, we'd give plenty of notice along with a designated grace period where we would not ban players for continued use, but would take action after that grace period has ended. So at this time, I can confirm that we have not banned anyone for using the minimap mod from Overwolf. Thank you for your feedback and support, Scott. So that's a dev post. Now let's get into it. Sorry for the wait. So, um, you know, there's, there's an option in here for filters and they're all disabled. You can't use them. So that kind of sucks. But if you have a secondary monitor or I tried it on the phone, can't get it to work. If you guys have any ideas, let me know because you can't actually get the New World Minimap app on your phone as of right now, or at least not for Apple. I tried it, it's only available for the PC version. So with that being said, as far as I know, you would either have to have a second monitor or just alt tab, which really sucks. So I highly suggest using this on a second monitor. I'm just trying to find a long enough HDMI cable to do it. But Minimap's great. You know, it's awesome. You can change the size, you can change the shape, you can make it a square, a circle, you can move it around. Here's medium, there's small, I like large. And then you could just, you know, drag it wherever you want. It's so easy to use, but it gets better. If you press this little button right here that says stream location, it will actually open in a browser, a map that you can use filters with. Yes, that is right. And it will show your position. So as a, for an example, I'm going to show you right now. Look at that. You can do your chest runs. You can do your, um, you know, moat farming, your earth shell turtle farming, 
anything you want. All the elite chests, all the supply stocks for trophies. I mean, how amazing is that? And even if you didn't want to use their map, let's say you like the other maps better, it's compatible with that too. Watch. New World map. Both of my favorite maps. So, you know, it's not working now. So you just click on enable location tracking. You have to log in. Oh, how did I get it to work? Am I logged in? There we go. Oh yeah, I am logged in. Okay, so where am I? Auto center on the map. There we go. And there I am, right there. And it's real time. Put whatever chests, whatever, you know, alchemy stuff, provision stuff. It's all there. Isn't that awesome? Oh, there's a supply stockpile right there. Look how easy that is. Zoom in. <laughs> Isn't that wild? And I mean, it is that simple, guys. Sorry, it was so loud. But uh, yeah, yeah, it's it's pretty nutty. I love it. Now, I'm pretty sure uh, AGS. If this is against the uh, terms of service, then you know, let us know. Give us a dev post. Let us know that we cannot be using this kind of functionality and only use the minimap with no third party, I don't know what you would even call it, a browser with the tracking streaming location. I mean, yeah, let us know if that's not okay. We'll stop using it, but for now, this is gonna make farming so much easier. Oh my God, just get a second monitor and away you go. And then um, I'll show you on this one how to do it too, the .io map. Uh, I think you gotta log in. So we'll just do that. Log in. And how do we, no. I'm not sure how to do it on this, I guess, but I know it's possible. Um, maybe you have to upgrade to the pro version? I don't know. Track category pro to track plugin two and add five modes. Okay, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how to do it on this one. Um, but I'm pretty sure there's a way. And uh, dang it. All right, well, you know, um, it definitely works on the on this one, so that's good. And then also the built-in one that they have for you. And it's so far, it's got uh, great, you know, it's got a great filter as well. It works. So, you know, if you want to do um, chest, make sure you go to ancient chest and supply stockpiles only. Do the tier three ancient chest and the tier three stockpile, none of the elites. And there you go. There, there's your chest run right there. Your trophy run, with real time, you know, filters working. It's it's great. So that's all I have, guys. Um, if you have any questions on how to get it set up or have any comments for me, how do you get the I/O map working? How to get it working on maybe your phone so that you don't have to have a second monitor and you don't have to alt tab? That would be great. So let me know. Hit me up. And uh, if you guys enjoy my videos, please like and subscribe. And uh, you know, I'm gonna. Um, moving into a new apartment so I'm gonna be streaming on Twitch and uh, you know I'll get all that stuff going too um, and if you guys have any suggestions on stuff that I haven't covered that you want to see stuff that people haven't covered very much or covered but not in good detail or you know 
stuff that you guys need to uh, to see, you know, different how to's or how do you do this, how do you do that, and can't find any help, let me know. I'll get on it right away. All right, guys, uh, it's been great. Take it easy. Oh, um, I had to put this at the end of the video. I totally forgot. I'm going to show you how to get the Overwolf mini map really quick. So, uh, just open up the browser. Um, I would Google uh, New World Minimap Overwolf. And right there. So I'm going to put this uh, link in the description. You just click on that. And I click Download Overwolf right away, but just wait for this and, and download this one right here. And then save it. I've gotten a couple now. <laughs> and just open that up. It'll install Overwolf for you. It will install the Minimap. And if you can't get it working, if it doesn't show up, make sure you restart your client. I couldn't get it to show up. I logged out to the main menu, still didn't show up. You have to completely close out to your desktop. So just escape, menu, exit the desktop, yes, restart the game, and it should pop up right there. Anytime you want to move it, you have to hit escape, escape, and you can just drag it around. There might be another way. It looks like tab can do it too. Oh, yeah, we don't want that there. That seems like a good place. Um, but yeah, yeah, so I'll just install it, follow the, you know, the prompts and everything, and you should be good to go. Um, and then I showed you guys how to do this. Uh, or did I? Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did. You just turn on location tracking. It requires the app to run in the background. So make sure you're running um, this app, which is right here. And if you're not sure whether or not it's running, you can just use the Wolverwolf Overwolf um game overlay so just go here and there's a a hot key to turn this on in the game too um maybe it's in here let me see settings uh hot key show hi no main map no where the heck is it Enabled overlay, okay. Yep, just make sure that's on. And then there's more, um, where is it, show. Auto launch location, toggle minimap. Oh, there it is, control tab, duh. Okay, so no overlay, control tab, overlay. And there's the minimap, make sure that's running. All right. And uh, that's it, guys. Now, have a good one.